Governor Abbott tweeting this afternoon, Texas is beginning to build its state border barrier. CBS 4's Bryce Helms spoke with one county judge who says he hasn't been told what the plan for the border states or the state's border wall is. The ability for us to be able to arrest people coming across the border is going to be enhanced by Texas building border barriers. Some of those barriers are being built immediately. As of June 28th, the Texas Facilities Commission hasn't hired a project manager to oversee the construction. But Governor Abbott tweeted this video. His office says this is state-owned land being cleared for border wall construction near Eagle Pass. Star County Judge Eloy Vera says no one from the governor's office has spoken to him about what the state's plan to build the border wall actually includes. Someone from his staff should approach us and, and tell us this is what we plan, this is what, what you know we're, we're trying to achieve. Uh, and, and this is how it's going to impact you guys. Vera says he wouldn't be opposed to sections of the wall being built in parts of Star County, but he won't agree to it until the governor explains the plan. My job is to protect uh, the citizens of this county to the best that I can and to make sure that whatever happens in this county is in their best interest. So I'm not going to commit to anything until I have all the information that I need. Governor Abbott announced earlier this month the state had a down payment of $250 million for the wall, but Vera says he doesn't think that'll be enough. The governor is talking about using $250 million for a wall. The federal government had billions of dollars, and, and they used billions of dollars to build three miles. So I don't think $250 million is going to go very far. Working for you in Star County, I'm Bryce Holmes. The Texas Tribune is reporting the state has received more than $450,000 in private donations for the wall.